The injury that Seth Rollins got on Raw during his battle against Jinger Mahal is more severe than was initially believed. As a result of this injury, WWE is now making significant adjustments, and there is a very sad update regarding Seth Rollins' injury on Raw. Due to the fact that WWE was compelled to rebook house programs, Randy Orton has been booked to take his place. Some people believed that the injury was a storyline that was written for Raw and that Seth would continue to wrestle at house shows and make appearances. However, it appears that the injury is as real as it gets, and it is not part of a script. WV has been forced to replace Seth Rollins at house shows on the road to the Royal Rumble and WrestleMania. Some fans of Seth Rollins are very angry at Jinder Mahal, because they believe that he is to blame for Seth Rollins getting injured. This is despite the fact that the move that caused the injury, which was a springboard moonsault, had nothing to do with Jinder Mahal. Jinder Mahal was down on the canvas at the time of the injury, so any blame that is directed toward Jinder is not deserved. We are aware that it was revealed a few months ago that Seth Rollins has been wrestling with a broken back, and that he doesn't have much time left in wrestling. On multiple occasions, Seth Rollins has suffered knee injuries. His right knee sustained a significant injury in November of 2015, and he was sidelined for about a year as a result of the injury. Despite the fact that he was the WWE champion, he felt compelled to leave. Is it possible that this is a recurrence of the past? In 2017, Seth Rollins suffered another knee injury, which forced him to miss two months of play. This occurred a couple of years after the initial injury. Not only does Seth Rollins suffer from a weak back, but he also suffers from knee problems. Unfortunately, there is some terrible news regarding the injuries that Seth Rollins has sustained and his future in WWE. He has knee problems. In light of the fact that there is new information regarding Seth Rollins in the hospital and the severity of his present injuries, let's get to these updates as soon as possible. Wade Keller, a wrestling journalist, broke the news that Seth Rollins had suffered a serious injury. He said that the injury's severity is very worrying. Wade reported that an unnamed wrestler who was backstage at Raw saw Seth Rollins backstage after his match with Jinder and he was limping severely, and, and this could be showing once again that this is a very real injury, and also this wasn't the kind of injury that lasts a couple minutes, and then you move on no this is an injury that needed to be attended to, and when you have a history of knee issues like Seth Rollins, something like this has to be taken very seriously, because as we know with professional wrestling, sometimes an injury is so bad that you may have to vacate your title you may have to take a year off, and obviously the worst thing is being forced to retire, and it's rumored that on the next edition of Raw de WWE, we'll make a major announcement concerning Seth Rollins. Obviously right now they are scrambling to try and make up for the absence of their champion now if you go back, and you really examine where Seth injured his knee, it was on the springboard moon's Saul to Jinder Mahal, and it looked very innocent, it didn't look like anything bad happened. But if you really examine the stills from the show, you'll see that as Seth comes down, his left knee SL slams into the canvas first, so instead of his whole body absorbing the blow, the left knee took the blow. And because Seth already had bad knees, putting all of that weight onto the knee as he crashed to the canvas was just too much, and the knee was severely damaged. But now the question is just how bad is this knee injury? Is this injury as severe as the one he suffered in 2015, which caused him to give up the title and stay out for over a year? Or is it the kind of ailment that will allow him to return to action the following week? The most recent information indicates that this is a pretty serious injury, which is the reason why he has been replaced in home performances at this time. Because WWE is aware of how serious this injury is, they intend to make a significant announcement on Raw when they do so. Despite the fact that they might not want to make the announcement public just yet, they are going to have to do so since it is evident that they have huge plans for Seth Rollins and his championship. On the road to WrestleMania, 
the injury comes at the worst possible time, as we were heading towards CM Punk versus Seth Rollins at WrestleMania. But now, it's very possible that may not happen, and obviously. When the news broke that Seth Rollins had to be taken to the hospital due to the injury he sustained on Raw, many fans were stunned beyond belief. But the person who was stunned the most and has been hit hardest by this is the wife of Seth Rollins. A. Lynch, Becky for the time being. Becky Lynch is making an effort to put on a brave face. You should know that she is currently attempting to sell her new book that is about her life, but at the same time, she is attempting to assist her husband in overcoming this awful circumstance. She has promised to be by her husband's side during this trying time, and right now, according to reports, Seth Roll is still in the hospital as doctors are doing everything they can to help Seth Rollins recover from this very serious injury. Sources close to Becky Lynch say that she is heartbroken and that she can't believe that this is happening. However, she has promised to be by her husband's side. In light of the fact that Seth Rollins has sustained an injury and WWE has been forced to make significant adjustments, what are your thoughts? Please share your thoughts with me by leaving a comment below, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the bell notification after you watch it.